The state's Cannabis Regulatory Commission delivered a shocking blow yesterday when it rejected the recreational license renewal for Cureleaf, the state's largest cannabis dispensary. CRC board members said they denied the license because Cureleaf failed to engage in collective bargaining with its union employees, a condition of maintaining their license in the state. Cureleaf says the move will cost some 500 New Jersey employees their jobs, and others are concerned the move could upend the recreational cannabis marketplace, which will hit its one-year anniversary next Friday. Melissa Rose Cooper attended the CRC meeting to bring us the latest on who else was approved and denied in this slow-moving marijuana marketplace. The resolution passes. A dream come true for Tahir Johnson as the Cannabis Regulatory Commission approved his application to convert from a conditional to annual license. Man, it was a hard journey. Um, everything from getting municipal approval to get in real estate, to um, getting investors, um, and now, you know, finally getting this license and hopefully being able to open my doors. Johnson's business was one of three awarded an annual license during Thursday's CRC meeting. But the commission also took surprising action against the state's largest cannabis supplier, Cureleaf. Almost one year after recreational sales began, the CRC declined to renew the company's adult use annual license. The commission citing a number of concerns, including an apparent layoff announcement that was made before the information was provided to the CRC. I think it's important for the board to have, and the staff as well at large, to have proper insight and timely notice of major changes to a facility operations. The CRC's decision coming just minutes after Cureleaf Chief Compliance Officer James Shores spoke about their commitment to serve the community since expanding into the adult use market. We've created more than 500 new jobs in, for New Jersey residents. Moreover, we're especially proud that 42% of the jobs filled in 2022 and 38% of the jobs of the jobs filled so far this year have uh, gone to those who represent diverse ethnic groups. Cureleaf calling the CRC's decision arbitrary as it is lacking in merits and legal basis. The company also saying it will adversely impact our employees, nearly 500 New Jersey residents and Cureleaf team members as much as it will harm the broader New Jersey cannabis market. Members of the CRC say they know the cannabis industry has its challenges, but they're proud of the progress that's been made so far. For instance, we've worked with the public to to develop rules for every class of licensure um, for cannabis businesses. We have tripled the number of medical dispensaries that are open to patients and approved more than 50 new adult use businesses. Uh, and of course, we saw the first ever legal recreational cannabis sales take place. But Senator Vin Capel doesn't feel the CRC is as transparent as it should be. I've got applicants in my district uh, who have been waiting for months, all of their approvals are done, that can't get on a list uh, uh, to, to get heard. He plans on introducing legislation that would take control of the state's cannabis industry from the CRC, placing it instead in either the Department of Health or Department of Treasury. Their uh, legislature would have more oversight. They had to come before the Budget Committee. They had to come before the legislature. We can look at their budgets. We can talk to them. We can engage with them. Uh, and I think that it would cut a layer of bureaucracy out right now. There's a, there's a big layer of bureaucracy. Um, you know, this this is nothing to do with with politics. This has to do with making sure that there is transparency around uh, how these applications are being done. It's not clear right now how the CRC's denial of Cureleaf's annual license will impact sales, but the company says it will continue working with the commission to get approval by any legal means necessary. For NJ Spotlight News, I'm Melissa Rose Cooper.